Craig, good friendly for you today? Really good, yeah. Got a lot out of that. Um, really good game. Um, it's a good Halifax team. Um, we learnt a lot more about our players and uh, what we need to do to improve going forward. 2-0 then at half time, but a, a good comeback. And you are going to find yourselves behind at times this season and you, you need those powers of recovery. Yeah, we had, um, I won't say an experiment, but we tried um, to have a look at a few things in the first half. Obviously, started a lot of the younger lads, if you like, and uh, so I thought it was important to see what they're like against a good opposition. And uh, then obviously a lot of the senior players come on towards the end. And so the dynamics of the game has just changed. But um, yeah, really pleased with what we created going forward. We're just going to do a few tweaks sort of defensively. Yeah, quite an impressive CV of players coming off the bench second half. And two of those got your goals. One was from the penalty spot and, and then an equaliser from Jordan Borough. Yeah, I think obviously what seven or eight of the subs, um, I felt no reason to really start them. I think um, I know all about them. I think the fitness levels are where they should be because most of them were involved in the playoffs. So it was important to get the other lads sort of games because um, a lot of them have not played much football um, in the last sort of seven, eight months, to be fair. The goals you did concede were both similar, albeit from different sides of the pitch, four whipped in and a man yeah. getting in, in front of his man. Yeah, I think if there were one disappointment, I think we started the game as a friendly and they started it as a really competitive game. They obviously come out with a lot of intent and I think they had a bit more aggression to them and any balls in the box they were really fighting for to try and score and I think it took us a bit to sort of realise that really, that it, it was a, a serious game. And uh, but yeah, so despite with the goals, but like I said, it's friendlies and that's what we're here for. Only three players I think got 90 minutes. One of those was your latest signing, Fraser Preston. How excited are you to have him on board? Yeah, really. Um, I've seen a bit of him in the reserves for Sheffield Wednesday. Um, I think he's a league player to be honest with you. Um, but obviously, as things happen, he become available, and uh, it's just um, refreshing to have a left-footed winger. I've been trying to get one for a while, and uh, he's 21 year old, and he's only going to get better. And I thought he was very good today, to be honest. And if you do operate with three up front, you've now got six players to play in those positions, so you've got real strength and depth in that area. Yeah, um, I thought all the front lads did well today. I think obviously Jordan Archer was disappointed he didn't score, and there'd be a few other chances that we had, but. Um, I think we're getting the chances in the moment and there's healthy competition now in them from places whether we play two up there or three. Um, they've all got different attributes as well which is important. One game to go I think at Huddersfield next weekend and just a chance to fine tune a few bits before the, the FA Cup game. Yeah I think the next two weeks we need to find a bit of consistency in um, how we want to go about things and, and get some combinations going. I think obviously the pre-season of uh, the physical work and getting minutes into players legs has gone now um, and we're full on now two weeks working hard. And you've got an FA Cup draw in the meantime. Um, you're normally guaranteed in a way draw, but typically this year, with, without a guaranteed home ground and potentially a clash with Gainsborough, you, you're inevitable to get the home draw this year. Yeah, it's um, it's unusual. Obviously, we're not going to find out until later we're playing. You're starting the season in the FA Cup, so um, there's no room for error. Um, but excited um, to start the season with a big game, and uh, it's an important competition for us.